Well, many of you took a day off today. Candidates vying for the MP seat in Victoria were hard at work pounding the pavement with a little help from their friends. In two weeks, Victoria will vote and candidates are bringing out the big guns. CTV's Stephanie Sherlock reports. Doubling the Green Party caucus will rock Canada. The leader of Canada's Green Party working the campaign trail for Donald Galloway. We need to rescue democracy from partisan politics. So my dream is Donald Galloway at my side. Pipelines and politics topping the Greens agenda. I think the clearest possible message in the upcoming by-election, if you are against all pipelines, is to vote for the Green Party. I will carry the message to Ottawa. Liberal candidate Paul Somerville speaking to the Women's Liberal Commission, focusing on flushing expensive plans for sewage treatment. When we waste a billion dollars for an unnecessary sewage treatment plant, we're not going to be able to invest in the things the city really needs, like storm sewers and a 21st century transportation infrastructure. His party leader, Bob Ray in Victoria yesterday to pay respects to our veterans and lend his support to Somerville's campaign. He's a good, he's a good fellow. Not to be outdone, the Conservative candidate bringing in reinforcements as well. Sort of born and bred here, and uh, so he knows the community very well. He'll be a great representative here. President of the Treasury Board, Tony Clement, not party leader and Prime Minister Stephen Harper, but a solid choice to bring home a message of fiscal responsibility. So jobs and the economy is the message to me, and I think the, the environment the federal government's created is ideal for Victoria to put up his hand and have a representative saying how important that is and how we want to participate in that. Following in Denise Savoie's footsteps, the NDP candidate may be the presumed frontrunner in the by-election, but he isn't resting on his laurels. Leader Thomas Mulcair returns to Victoria tonight, joining candidate Murray Rankin and Savoie for a rally at the Victoria Conference Centre. Stephanie Sherlock, CTV News, Victoria.